Hey water lovers, so I'm totally excited today because I'm going scalloping. I love scalloping so much because you know what it makes me feel like? It makes me feel like I'm Easter egg hunting and when you open the scallop, you get something better than a piece of candy. Scallops are one of my favorite foods for sure. Anyway, I'm gonna give you some fun tips and tricks on scalloping today. Who will win? Getting the most scallops. Ryder or mom? Ryder or mom? Do you think you're going to win, Ryder? I don't know. I'm gonna win, because he doesn't know. Gonna go scalping, gonna go scalping. Okay, things we need. We definitely need a lot of water. And hey, a best friend is always great. A captain that knows what he's doing. We need fins, snorkels, a mask. A little mesh bag would also be great to put your scallops in. A phone case so you can take underwater pictures and don't forget your dive flag. Also, don't forget some water for the pups if you've got them on board. Check out these cute little Frenchies. They are adorable. Whenever you need a scallop break, they're the best to go pet. Oh, Frenchies on a float, Frenchies on a float. Woo, woo, woo. Okay, favorite tips I've gotten for scalloping is they love to camouflage themselves. So the best place to find them is in distressed sands near seagrass areas. They also like to hide in sand holes. So put your hands on the ground and feel for those scallops. You'll eventually feel them in between the seagrass. And sometimes I like to get up into the seagrass with my mask. Check out this cutest pup ever. She's like, what is that thing? Maybe I want to eat it. <laughs> and we did so good scalloping today. I think we got enough for about four people to eat. So that's pretty awesome. I feel successful. Also, guess who won the scallop contest? Mom did. Anyways, thanks so much for watching um, this video today and hope you enjoyed scalloping with us.